Hey, good morning everyone so today is Wednesday and I'm going to go to the gym I decided that I'm just not gonna let anything interfere with my fitness journey Monday I wasn't able to go to the gym and train with a personal trainer because her dog was ill and she felt that the dog was gonna pass away that day or they were just gonna have to put her down on Monday and that was gonna be like my entryway of going to the gym seeing what I should work on because my midsection is more of my concern I just want to get that nice and tight but because she was not able to meet I just didn't go to the gym anyway and so it's been Monday Tuesday Wednesday I did get this car Monday so that was a achievement I was really happy I at least got a car I at least did something Monday even though I didn't go to the gym but I still need to work out I don't want any interferences with my fitness journey I just have to make it happen so today's Wednesday I'm gonna go to the gym it's gonna be my first time in at least five years I know it has been a long time since I've been to the gym and there's no more excuses. I just have to go to the gym and just be healthier. I may even take a class. I don't know. I have to wash my hair later and then work on some content. So I'm not going to be at the gym too long. And plus, I really just want to ease my way into the gym because it has been a long time since I last went to the gym. I don't want to burn myself out. I don't want to make it an obstacle and feel like I have to do so much. And then I just don't want to go. So come along with me. Okay, so just a quick update i was on my way to the gym but i was getting a little hungry i saw starbucks Whoa. look at this i was about to show you my drink and then the lid popped off okay so i only got a single shot but there is a lot of caramel i felt like i just need a little bit to get me a little motivated so this is a venti ice caramel macchiato it's a single shot and then i have extra caramel drizzle in there i really like it so it has vanilla syrup and i put caramel syrup in there and of course here is my water so i'm not slacking i had a little bit more water today than this so i'm doing okay and i had a butter croissant so now I just have to find some parking. It is such a beautiful day out. So now I'm ready to go to the gym. It is so nice out. It's really sunny. So I'm going to hurry up, go to the gym, wash my hair, and style it, and then I can go to the park with my children. Okay, I'm feeling just a little bit nervous because I don't want to say I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm going to go on the treadmill. Like I said, I'm going to keep it light, but when I went to the gym before I signed up and everything, all the machines are different. Than what I remember so I just don't want to make a fool of myself <laughs> I will show you the machines and everything in there and show you how much I weigh now I drank some water so I want to take a pound off plus I'm gonna have my shoes on so let's just see how this goes <laughs>
really good workout like i said i really wanted to ease into the gym it has been so long that i have not been to the gym and i was using my pregnancies as an excuse then i said well once my daughter you know i wanted a girl so i didn't want to go to the gym lose all this weight then gain weight back and then have another child and do all of this so i just kind of wanted to get all my children out of the way I finally got my girl so i'm really happy <laughs> about that and she just turned one so you know it's just like i cannot prolong this the excuse before was i don't have the time i had to take care of my two older children and they also have a daycare here so my children can go there so that's really not an excuse anymore then i was working you know i just didn't really have the time and this and that and then i have more children you know i just kept making excuses excuses i said once my daughter turns one i'll go she just turned one a few months ago you know there's no more excuses i'm really really happy i went the first machine was the elliptical even though it looked like i was not doing much i, <laughs> I was like whoo after 10 minutes my heart rate i think the average was like 174 then i did some machines because i want to tone i want my body to be nice and toned so right now i'm not really happy with the way my body looks i just want to be toned i just want to be back to my pre-pregnancy weight after my second son a little bit after because i was i lost a lot of weight after him and i was one like 114 which was not a healthy weight i had a lot of i don't want to say fun but i'm really happy that i went to the gym i took the step no more excuses i will be going back to the gym maybe friday and all the machines that i went on are targeting the areas that i want to firm i just kind of want to work on my midsection that section is nuts I'm just not so proud of that. And I have this shake right here. This is the PB and B shake, the vegan PB and B. And it has some peanut butter, of course, it's protein. And I had a couple other things, but I really like peanut butter. So I had a shake last time I was here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I went to the gym like maybe a month or two ago just to get some food now you know when I went in the gym I wasn't a member yet and I was like this is bad like I'm going to the gym to get the food but I'm not even working out <sighs> so yeah I definitely had to go to the gym I'm really happy my mom is going to come she's not gonna join but me going to the gym I do get some passes so I'm going to take her let me know if you are interested in my fitness journey because if not, I'm not going to bother vlogging or making videos about it. If you want to be on a fitness journey, let's kind of talk and motivate each other because we all need it. I know that it took me a long time, it took me years to get back in the gym, but now I'm here, now I'm happy, I'm motivated. Definitely coming back in a couple days. I wanna to say tomorrow, but I'm gonna have my hair in twist and I just don't want to sweat it out. So I'll just wait till I take it down and I guess I'm gonna sweat it out. My whole routine is gonna be different now. I'm probably gonna have to wash my hair twice a week instead of once. I'm gonna have to definitely use maybe different products, making sure that I'm using a scalp exfoliator or certain shampoos. Maybe I have to clarify my hair twice a month. Instead, I'm definitely gonna have to make sure that my hair stays nice and clean and my pores not get clogged, all of that. I mean, <sighs> that is what you have to think about when being a natural, making sure you have healthy hair and going to the gym. Let me know how you like this vlog so I can make some more if you like it. And I will see you later. Bye.